Dobre utro, good morning. Here in Tiraspol, we're going off on a jolly today. We're going over to Benderi or Bender on the other side of Dun the Dunista River. We need to go and hopefully catch the old Soviet trolley bus. Number 19, I think. And then, yeah, that's the plan. See what it's like. It's like a smaller town, smaller town city. So off we go. Got on the trolley bus, got kicked off the trolley bus after about one minute. Because we don't have a bloody face nappy. So we're going to have to try and find a mushroom because there's a few coming. Hopefully we make it to Bendery. It's been it. You play now, man. We made it on the Marsh route, because <laughs> that's the only mode of transport we're allowed on. And here we have the big sign, Gorod Benderi, Bender City, 1408. Look at that car. That's our favourite colour car ever. Look at this place, look at that tower flat, wow. So we'll go for a wander. Food first, obviously. I think there's another one of those Soviet canteens we went to the other day. Maybe we're gonna get some borscht, good hearty bowl of borscht for breakfast, and then let's just see what we can find. We just drove past a huge fortress on the way in. Looks really impressive. I don't know if you have space to get in, we'll see. Check this bar out, magazine. Bintorg. Look at the curtain blowing. Yeah, so first impression of Benderi is it looks like not as much money has been pumped in here. Everything's a bit more dilapidated, but it's full of character. Toilet. <laughs> it's cool here actually. But like just outside the bus station, Mushroom Station. Whoa! <laughs> Nearly got fish juice splashed on my face there. Yeah. Thirty-five rubles. This place is absolutely mental. There's a fake Mackie's there. Loads of puppies in the cage. Look at this building. So we're back in the other CCCP cantina. The lady was super nice. Look at the inside of this one. It's a little bit different than the other one. We've got old school live telly on there. We're just going for a classic, another borscht <laughs> with, um, with the cream and then a sausage. And what is this stuff before we... I'm just gonna try it. I don't know what it is. Is it like... I don't know, it's like porridge here. Here we go. So yeah, 60 rubles for us both with a drink each. Delicious. It's really good. Here we go, that was actually really tasty. I'm just showing you a bit of the 
the scenery on the way out. What's this map? Is it the old money? What's the map? This is the, the whole of the Soviet Union back in the day. From all the countries, Turkmenistan. Look at that. Completely different than the one now, isn't it? We're off back out. Onto the mental streets. This is actually the central market we stumbled across. Didn't realise, but it's... This is like stepping back in time, back, back into the bloody Soviet days. You want to look at the puppies? I don't know. Oh, it's a donation. Do you want to donate to the pup? I think they're for sale. Do you want to do it? Do you want to do it? There's kittens as well. Oh. It's whatever. I think it's like a charity. So yeah, there's a huge beautiful church over there. And let's take a look around. There's a fake McDonald's. Loads of people selling kvass because it's a hot summer day. And we'll just head into the central market. I don't know what's going on here. So heading into the market streets, I think this is a huge market hall on the left. Sorry. And then there's just an outdoor bit around it selling all kinds of stuff. Yeah, it's a huge indoor hall. Wow, they've got their old weighing scale. Should we go inside? You want to? Yeah. It's massive. It's a glasses shop. Got some new glasses. <laughs> Look at this. This is like the old Blackburn market. Yeah, this is like an old English market in here. All the pick and mix jockeys. The way of these sweets, you actually don't know what any of them are because they're all in packets, unless you're from here. So we just get a massive selection and then it's just like a like a mystery sweet. You don't know what you're going to get. Do we get some on the way out? Yeah. What are these mushrooms? That. Yeah, mushrooms. It's one of the best honey in the world, this. It's a nice honey, it's a Probe? You want to try some? Da, malinka. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm Good? Well done. I'll just have some of this. That's really good. Wow, how do you say sweet? Slab, 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 slab. I just, I just, I just, Acacia? Acacia. Spasiba. Gusny? Gusny, da, da. Come here, you're going to drink Спасибо. Откуда? Англия. Англия. Англия, да. Англия. 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 I love it here because it seems like it's like, I know I always say Latin America, but here they use every part of the pig or the animal like they do in Latin American countries like that, which is, which is what you should do. You shouldn't just eat the like chicken breast, for example, and all the Western bits.
at the pig head. It's chopped in half. Have it. This lady's got all the tea in the world, all what the chai. Have a sniff of it. Um, it is. Is it? Yeah. Oh, it smells good. Maybe we should, you should get a little bag. I'm gonna, so 15. Is it that 15? No, it's 15. Is it Rosa? Yeah. Uh, it's it's quite nice. Like Ma Malinka? Huh? Ma Malinka? Yeah, it's good. It's good. Oh, so <laughs> that big cup full. <laughs> it smells good, doesn't it? So it goes by the, maybe it goes by the cup. How much is it? Oh, this is that. At least this is what we've had rakia with before. <laughs> I think we've had a rakia made with this before. I don't know what any of these things are. <laughs> How much is it? I don't know, I gave it 25. I think it's good. Skolko, etas, yes. So what's this? Huge bag of tea. It's a huge bag of rolls tea. So what like 75 tea? Yeah. If you want tea, it's a good place to come here. They always have like huge tea stalls with like you just saw there, pretty much everywhere in this part of the world. So we'll see what else we can find. <laughs> it looks good. Was that the most expensive yeah. one? Yeah. It's rolled, isn't it? That's fine. It looks good. Mm. It smells good. But just look at this place. It's mental. Like, it's, it's honestly, it is like going back in time. All the ladies. Oh, it's just like an outdoor bit, fruit and veg bit maybe, yeah. She's got like fresh chai on there. It's a mobile coffee man walking around. The mark, the Tiraspo. Yeah, this market's better than Tiraspo by a mile. This is like, this is legendary tier market. The car parks here are just a retro car party. Like back there, every other car is a Lada or something similar. It's mental. Like all different colours. It's crazy. So nice. I wish we could have one. Wonder how much they cost if you bought one here though. Maybe no one would sell them. I wouldn't sell mine. I'd run it into the ground. Oh, they've got some good socks. They're okay. They've got Gucci's. What did the bamboo kids? Yeah. These are for you. There's uh, my. Ah, Jen's kids should Get a nice pair of bamboo socks. I've never had bamboo socks. Bamboo socks? I've never had bamboo socks either. I think they're a quid. A quid up uh, off this lovely lady. I think we found the second hand area because they just. We're going to go in this big warehouse in a second, but everything's so cheap. Look, all the four 10 rubles, which is 50p. Wow. Let's go in this bit. Wow. 
got Mr. Mazzo again. Mazzo de la Merced again in Mexico. It's a big open market with a concrete floor. I just need to show you the scale of this market so you can see that whole way there. There's just dozens and dozens of them in like every direction. It's so big. This is the local place to shop, isn't it? This is where you'd come. Is it the coffee lady? <laughs> and this coffee lady's like that, just stood dotting about. Got the back of that car. This is fuck new cars. I'm driving old school. And then we've got the Bridnestrovia Tir. What's that, a gun shop? I think it's an air gun store. So to get to Bendery from Tiraspol, it's Mashrutka number 20 if you're gonna come over. Down this little alleyway. This little, little extra bit of the market. such a crazy place here, it's well worth it here. like, it's like another world, it is just, like look at the huge building there with the clock, the old style clock in it, and look at all these Soviet trolley buses. It's mental. It is like a Soviet wonderland. Like, look at them. I'm playing Despacito now. Really? <laughs> He's nailing that accordion. <laughs> We're down by the banks of the Dresda River and there's this huge abandoned dilapidated building. There's noises coming from in there. I don't know what it is. I don't know if I'm allowed to have a look. Wow. <laughs> what a place. It's like being back in Chernobyl. The geese around there. Almost got me a dog, I think. This place is mental. The huge balcony. Wow. Look at this from a banner Soviet building. This goes up and up. So we're right on the Dniester River here. It's incredibly beautiful. Bridnestrovia, it's, it's just so green. Apart from like the odd city. And then it's mostly just villages and just look. There's all the cows over there. Going for a drink and a walk by the river. The river looks a lot nicer here than in Tiraspol. It's well nice. We've got a huge memorial here, but they're doing loads of work, so we can't actually get across. We're gonna have to keep going down the river. Look at these old school curvy benches. Oh, yeah, imagine getting your spine in that position. Can't be good for you. Not very ergonomic, that. <laughs> We've hit an old Soviet amusement park. 
on the banks of the Dniester. And there's people here, so I'm hoping some of this stuff runs, but if not, it's super cool. Check it out. Obviously some of these are for kids. I mean, it does look quite fun though. It's like um, when we're at Chernobyl, but it's in a bit, it's not um, like nuclear abandoned. It's just abandoned. Or is it? Let's have a look. Look at how cool this place is. <laughs> this is sick. This looks fun. Never been in one of these. I want to go on like an adult one that's like in the sky. I'll tell you what, it's roasting here. I'm sweating my head off. Look at the bumper cars. Jesus. Oh, and the ticket booth. Let's see if there's anything that we can go on. This is the most legendary ride on the planet. It's like little ships that obviously they don't work anymore, but look at those. Look at the control sticks. It's mental. It's like a little kid park. I don't think there's anything for adults here. But check it out. It's so interesting here. Look at this little roundabout you're sitting. Mental. Wow. <laughs> That'll make me sick. Make me sick borscht everywhere. This one works. Kiddie one. Wow. Incredible. Oh, it's just for kids. <laughs> Is it? No problem. You're getting told off. <laughs> We're going on the kiddie stuff. I think it, it does say for kids. Idiots. <laughs> so, theme park fail. Everything's just for kids. And we got told off. But look at the buildings. All the walls are like swimming pool tile floored and crumbling pieces. What's this? A cafe? Oh, a little train as well. There's a train. And that's about it. It's a little kiddie, kiddie theme park. Interesting though. Just take one last glimpse. Of the Soviet past here before we head back to Tiraspol because it's far too hot now. Just look at the place. This is good though. That like area has like pull up bars, gymnastics bars, legendary swing. This one's got no backrest. <laughs> Soviet sandpit, big tractor tyre. I don't know what that's for, you can use your imagination. And then yeah, just, just check it out, man. Crazy. What a place. Been dirty. Yeah, we're gonna go and hop on a marshrut Quebec for five rubles and have a nap. We've got a quick Russian honey cake to end the day off. How much was it? 18, 18 rubles. I've never tried this before. It's actually really good. Mmm. Mogo. Thank you so much, lovely to meet you. Goodbye. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye. And welcome, welcome. Oh, have I got yes. it? Yes. My dog. Yes. yes. It is, it is I've got your number. Very nice. We have your number. I've got it. Yes, yes, yes. So, perfect. Okay. Bye bye. 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 Bye b
Okay. Пока. She's all over the lady now. We've been quite a few times to this cafe, the Cafe Shafran. And she's been so nice to us every time. Like the first time when she made us the, she made us like a homemade borscht and brought it in, it was super nice. She said, if you come back, we can go for borscht. She gave us a number and said, what, what's happened? Every day. <laughs> every day. She went like this, every so. day. Oh, she, she spoke really good English, Charlie. It's like she's been practicing little bits this week. Yeah. So that's everything from Menderi and Tiraspol. Had a well good time here. Yeah? Seven she days. It's been. Name, but we last saw her like three days ago. Oh, she's lovely. Absolutely lovely. Angela, she's called. So yeah, thanks for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>